Good morning, church. Because of Christ. My name is Simpue Ngube, and I'm coming from Victoria Falls, Zimbabwe. Hallelujah. Uh, my brother, you may tell us your wonderful testimony. Okay, so my testimony goes like this. I have always aspired to be part of the junior leadership of the city. So whenever the man of God prayed for me, I would put it in my heart as the days of the interviews came near. So around June, we went for our interviews. And yes, by the grace of God, I was part of those who were selected to be the junior councillors of the city of Victoria Falls. Hallelujah. I would want to watch the monitors of our screen, our brother, to explain what exactly was happening here. Yes, by the grace of God, uh, one day we were called at the Elephant Hills. There was a meeting for the junior councillors with the UNICEF regional director. So right there I was standing with the junior minister of state and provincial affairs in Mad North and Devolution. Okay, so it didn't end there, people of God. As you know, if you are a son of a prophet, you know you go higher and higher. Hallelujah. My brother, you said as a son of a prophet, you were expecting to go higher and higher. And I believe indeed God did it for you. What next happened in your career? So, ah, people of God. One service, I told the man of God my wish because there was a higher stage that was open for the councillors to be given posts. Uh, so before that, I had a dream. Um, I dreamt I was standing at the right side of the church building and I saw a bed. That bed had uh, feathers going down, it had no feet, it had feathers. So it went and landed by the Chirao alongside the messy land. So I told myself in my heart that, ah, let me go and pick feathers because it was dropping feathers. So as I went to pick the feathers, I realized that I was holding a bigger feather that was shining on my hand. So I went there, it dropped the feathers. I picked them up and I picked them up. So. I told the man of God the dream as I was telling him my wish. He said, the grace that you are crying for, you've already received it. Um, we waited for our induction. Our induction is where we are taught on how to carry out our duties, how to behave ourselves as junior leaders. And that's where they, we vote for posts to give people posts. So it's delayed up to the 15th of December. So we went for our induction. You know, people of God, as a child, you gauge yourself by others, you know? I saw others, they were campaigning, they were on fire, this and that, and I became very worried. But I, I told myself in my heart that the God that my father, Prophet, promised saves is the God of Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego. So the induction went on, uh, people voted, and yes, by the grace upon my father, Prophet Promise, I was voted the most, and by the grace of God, I was given the title as his worship, the junior mayor of the city of Victoria Falls. Hallelujah. I would want to watch the monitors of our screen. 
as we watch our junior mayor in the house. Hallelujah. Uh, my brother, now that God did this wonderful wish in your life, you involved the servant of the Lord, Prophet Promise, in your career. And now that you were elected as a junior mayor of Victoria Falls, what would you also like to advise your younger ones, your age mates, and those who are watching you all over the world? So my simple advice to my age mates is be serious with the things of God. In God, that's where your destiny is. You can't go anywhere and prosper. In God, there's everything that you want. Thank you. Hallelujah. My brother, we celebrate with you. We say go and make the word of the Lord the standard of your life. And the best is yet to come in your career. Thank you.